This way here. Um, yeah. So pull on that one. Yeah, the buckle is centered as much as possible. It's like, okay, I could keep going down this path, then I know what that looks like. Or I could do something else. So yeah, that's why I chose. My name is Scott Beisch. Came from a family of Air Force. My dad was in the Air Force. His dad was in the Air Force. Flew C-17s for what's called the pilot training commitment for 10 years. Total years of service in Air Force was 12 years. You know, I think my health and wellness has been important to me. So this is the Salt Lake River Trail. You know, I'm not as active, you know, for my previous job in the military. So I said, okay, I'm ready to be in a place where I can be a little bit more stable. Because I was now on the civilian side, I feel like I've stepped out of it. I, I feel like I'm pretty active. I like hiking, I do day trips, but it's just like me and my dog. <laughs> I feel like this was a reminder like that it's there and that like it's important. It was, I thought, I thought it was kind of unique because you could be a civilian and join RWB as a member and you didn't have to technically be in the military. But I like the idea of this kind of forming a community around veterans, not just of veterans. I think it's important to keep with that. We kind of really clicked as a group, like from really day one. And you know, sometimes you, you have reservations about doing something, but then once you do it and commit to it, it's like, oh, that was that was really cool. There's gonna be a lot of memories and photos that I can look back on and really, you know, just really enjoy from this time.